Mobetaya, Yakasade for industrial minerals huh? and requirements of so Koko to be benefit awarded my or minor uh, illegalities around sand and stone winning negative impact on communities and the environment. Yet is uncommon in our last week. And then, you will see a focus on something very, very interesting and of interest to most of you uh, gender mainstreaming and the elimination of child labor in mining. In the Akwanya Befasona, you know, Anomoma will not be denied opportunities about mine. And Ankolansua, Obeko Galamse sites be bri na Nkola, Nkola, and I need show video be. Does do you still have that video? on Asimba FM. I think I do. I think I do. Inti, Mesha sabi video Nkola pa na ejina Galamse pit muse omo horo deyo, omo horo deyo. Na eh 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 eh. Ne ni e nyai, ne ni e nyai. Pa 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 pa. I think I still have it. Aha, uh -huh, I do have it here. Inti, me sende na afi. Mohu, ye kase enkola a war into mine, then why a water minerals commission for a two one among and it's at the heart of him. Come on, you ever be the end of the area. No, you know, so much me who said any other is he at it. Ain't it to help us on this discussion? No, uh, yeah, but come minerals commission and uh, a very interesting discussion. And uh, yeah, but about have with CC and I'm who said any other is he echo, uh, Mona Lean. Mona Lane, Anoche Bempa, or a senior officer, gender and international affairs, Ewo Minerals Commission. Madam Akwabana, a point is saying, Bibi Aboko, it didn't say me bone, yea, Mona Lane. Okay, Mona Lane, Anoche Bempa. Wow. And you can gender mainstreaming in mine and I, there they are. Um, we the me fa kwai so a chia eti phone na na kasa no so we the me pamu chwa wa ye the be fa fa kaka. No problem. No problem. Ye say gender mainstream na um puto kasa muno. Ye be kasa e um a strategy or a tool. Ye de she say um say be a ye ye policies and our programs be a ye be she kwai a say be a be impact e um obia. In my, in my, my, and cry, a crying bend, ye be fast way a day into two year, be two ye, send ye be ya who be a home, enka, ne be be a ada pepe. Oh, okay, okay. It is about mine in the more, and I just say, more and more policy makers and implementers, no. When we say some policies, I'm going to be a bear affect you, be a positively, positively, patch eye. Very important. Indeed, at the Minerals Commission, more gender unit war, patch eye. Our Minerals Commission. Hey, now link you know, why why a gender unit or minerals commission if eh, mm -hmm. um gender units because uh, mining no say be be train ya dwa kwai chi ka kai um for so many years they are na a member titru pa na ya mining no not just in Ghana i think it cuts across uh, most of our mining countries yes. um, around the globe yes. and you know near um commission e hu ye ne say I'm saying you drew pen pen swa, both nationally and then globally. No, you can't gender a man who has same baby or say you didn't to you. It's a two-hour crime. Now a man so swing your chefa, a free a good year year to know him. See, I should say the African Mining Vision. Yes, it's it looks at gender, even the sustainable development goals that. Yes, we are currently um, implementing yes. goal five. No, it's also on gender equality. Mm -hmm. The national policy framework. So, so I hear when then the, in 2015 we had the national gender policy, okay. which also looks at um, um, the gender issues. So, obviously, there's a discourse around, around gender. gender. Yes, in the Minerals Commission, so so we say, my name, no, a quite bad, yeah, be fastwa, yeah, be my gender issues, no, so so, um, yeah, dear, so a quemu. Unfortunately for the mining sector, no. I said a midi kind kind, a mema, and a dorsum, omune, yebeka se omu benefiting more. They are benefiting more in terms of the employment. Obviously, we are so we are juma, we are nyeska, we are crying, we are deaf. We are not saying a ma any mukra, a ma womb. Now, mining is also a large scale, any small scale. 
Now, she has small scale now. A ma won't pie, and there reports need be cried to me. A state to say, A man, it does or say, A man. But the issue is a day, a jume day, and a omo ye, a womb, a honey near assembly, because there we are no, and a bema, we nesica, a mood. A man was so would be a chef, and would be so a show. Okay. And to say, I share small scale now, yes, a ma woho. Mm. So if you look at the um, small scale sector value chain, I man no form cra to say you may be to so more washi. Um the qua cotto are born if you be picoli coli, um cotto are born no ma wash it. Now almost any baby um benyan be pick a cra a dear free mo yet be brain nine and your concession owners and I say beca say be a mine we de a ma we mo edia in the commission edia tony wants to say on us or befa quaya or besha no dia boa ama ye to me I empower a man na a man is sweet to me ya a good dear na ye to no a much not just for the small scale but also um, at the large scale because okay. large scale has also so issues can crowd. Oh, oh, oh. Uh -huh. But the good idea. thing with the large scale is because most of the companies, uh, well, mother companies, foreign uh, mother companies, mm -hmm. no, they are also, the discourse is also out there. So they are also measured and they are also trying to put in measures. Ah, Ebema, the sector will be more inclusive. More inclusive. Most of the gender units, no, I ask commission, no. Uh, mm -hmm. Nioma Ben a unit netimi achieve. And the yes, yes, set it up um, more effectively from latter part of 2019. Mm -hmm. And unfortunately um, for us, when we came in, at the time we were reviewing the local content regulations, yeah. and so, you know, we made inputs. And so, with that, you know, um, we believe it, it, it's um, a positive indication of the. It's, now, it's not just being committed and saying that, oh, we mm -hmm. are committed to um, gender mainstreaming in mind, but yes. then we are putting, um, we are taking steps to ensure that it's really actualized or mm -hmm. it's realized within the sector. Mm -hmm. So, in the local content regulations, which was passed, I think, in 2020, mm -hmm. you see that there are provisions in the the um we've also undertaken some projects we will start to with the camera yeah they answer what yes you bro from katrina my i'm a patch of my projects and so we also uh, we don't work in isolation mm -hmm. because um osha a juman of commission inquiring to me yeah and you know your name um, stakeholders like the chamber of minds mm -hmm. like the um, because obviously they are the uh, math piece mm -hmm. of the of the industry. industry. We also have civil society, and we work very well with um, women in mining. Okay. I guess you you know them, yeah. and um, they are also doing quite well in the sector. So yes. we we work with them on um, a project in the Savannah region mm. to um, to help with the gold capture and also to help women to mine um, okay. responsibly. Okay. So I think those are and the age man is so it's not just on the women. It's also looking at the child labor child issues, labor, yes. um, as you said. But then um, child labor is another challenging, a challenging area. Challenging in the sense that it's um, um, an issue that goes to the core as of our development you know, agenda, an issue of poverty. Mm -hmm. So um, um, as one writer puts it, it's um, an intricate web. Yeah. So how yeah. do we untangle that web? Mm -hmm. Because if you're able to address the issue of poverty, so we see mines. Because from our laws, child labor is Outlawed. In this Arabia, year under 18, echo mines are because of the dangers in the. Mm. But interestingly, parents themselves push their and children the in there. So that's what makes it very challenging. Especially on um, illegal mining. Illegal mining. mining. Mm. No, that's where it is. For yeah. the legal sector, no, because they know the um, remedies, of as course. in the sanctions that. Because. Um, if if it's found that um, we will engage your children, it could even go to the extent of affecting your licensing. Yeah. So yeah. they are not into that. They understand I the the work that we are doing mm. and the role of the commission in addressing that. Because also it also has the negative effect in terms of our gold. Mm -hmm. The the 
um, um, the responsible supply yeah. agenda yeah. Of, of, of the commission. Yeah. So it's very, very a serious issue. Mm. But then the illegal sector no, or the illegal mining areas, no, that's where FDA. we have this whole no child one. labor. Mm. And, and I think it's, it's uh, the good point to show video. No? Jackson, my, my interest in video is what we mean by child labor in mining, illegal mining, obviously. Uh, this video went viral, I think, last year or two, and uh, and Kuala uh, by a uh -huh, video in Oba Oba Facebook. I will be a Sempai FM page on Facebook. You would see the video of in Kuala Na Omoso Ewo Eyimo Eye Eha. It will be a show. We have a Omo Eye Washing. Omo Jinansu Ni Me Omo Shibako Ekra. Your friend is saying several. Or the theater channel now, or the agum no more can air wash it. It's a really, really terrible video. So, I'll be sharing Kola, age or more, and the kind of job are not more. Yeah, these are some of the things that uh, commission a person where they are doing at the Ifriho. Ain't he specifically near my band a commission or aye to stop Sadie? Child labor, no, as I said, say a poverty issue. Mm -hmm. So for us, we um, the commission commission named Kwan to me. We we are working with um, the child labour unit of the Ministry of um, Employment and Labour Relations okay. on this, and also um, ILO also helped us um, help the commission. I think prior to 2019, mm -hmm. with the Caring Gold project, which recorded some. Um, successes in the in the area which we are also building on as mm -hmm. well in our dance ain't you know um, child labor need your best way we are speaking to the minds and hearts of people especially parents because we went to there so um, last year okay and the issue was yeah yeah because these are coming from the citizens themselves say yeah 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 in Kosku, na Nessica, and Neomo Benyentino, Yomon Cog, my son, Koyage, my we are also forgetting that it has a long term impact on their health, which is something we are not as parents or whoever pushed their child in there. We fail to think of, of the long term effects on, on the child. Even if you are not, if the child is going to miss out on education, what about the health impacts that this child is yes. going to face in future? So as a commission, yes, we are doing more sensitization programs to speak to the hearts and minds of, of people so that people, once they understand and appreciate the, the issue, that especially with the impacts, the health impacts, people are more likely to um, withdraw their children mm -hmm. And then um, we also um, working. We'll also be working with the um, Ministry of Gender, the social welfare units at the district level, yeah. so that when these children are withdrawn, they also take it up because we can only withdraw reports mm -hmm. that these children are involved. Then they also take up the next action, mm. so that the the, the the children can be trained into various skills. So you are how best we place them in, uh -huh, in school. Mm. Yes. Okay. In the wama yehu niyama moya as a commission to deal with this. And earlier on gender mainstreaming, no, moya challenges be ana in really rolling out policies are a bit mainstream gender in in in, in the commission. Um, I think that one key challenge to this whole gender concept is the issue of um, acceptance and then mm -hmm. culture. Okay. Culture in the sense that we are built to, um, or we are developed socially to think it that um, the woman's role is in the, kitchen, in the kitchen, especially in our context of, uh, of the world, yeah. in the African context. And in the time, we and our whole channel was so worrying, it was so shifting, it was so weird. Mm -hmm. So, yes, ch culture is a key issue. Because if I remember well, when we went to the savannah to have that engagement in the, the women even had to more or less, excuse me, I'm not saying it's wrong, mm -hmm. but then they needed to seek permission from their partners, their partners to be 
to be even involved in in, in the project. Mm. I'm not saying it's wrong. Nobody should get me wrong on that. But then we should also be able, we should be empowered to be able to take certain decisions by ourselves. Because we all have those abilities and um, capabilities. Mm -hmm. So culture is a key challenge. Then again, to um, there, there is the issue of um, funding which we all know it's a general problem mm -hmm. everywhere. Yeah. So um, I think those are the two. And also the acceptance, the okay. acceptance of the gender concept mm -hmm. because there's stereotyping and biases against, against women. And women. Once, you know, people see you as gender um, advocate mm -hmm. or mm -hmm. someone working they towards equality, then yeah. they see you in a different <laughs> light as feminist, you are tagged. Yeah. It's a whole issue yeah. and once it comes up, oh, it may, it mm -hmm, may, but mm -hmm. gender is not just about women. Yeah. I think that's one thing that we need to state clearly. But we are in a sector where the um, women issues have been relegated for a very long time to the background. Mm. So now we want to bring those issues up so that um, we have this consciousness. We are self-aware. Say, a man so so. It has an implication on them, on them. the youth, the children within the mining space okay. so that we put things in place uh, it will be fair or balanced mm -hmm. for for a sustainable growth okay my, my answer finally the specific project uh, commission will rule really out to include women and to bring them on board a, a project being sir um, as I said in, um, um, earlier on our mm -hmm. discussion, I made mention of the um, local content uh, regulations yeah. that we've passed, that yeah. is seeking to where we have provision on the um, recruitment, mm -hmm. so that we the, the aim, we have the guidelines in place, it which we hope to pass. Um, one key thing in there is to have um, a, a one-third gender rule, so that okay. we don't have more than two-thirds of um, of a sex group mm. within an organization, okay. not more than two thirds of that, FDM. right from the lower level, even up to the board level. So for the commission, for instance, we've started, fortunately for us, our board chair is the woman mm. in the person of Honorable Barbara um, Otin, yes, Otin, yes, yes, okay. the former minister former for- Former MP and yes, former minister, minister for, for tourism, tourism yes. okay. And then we also have our deputy CEO, the first female deputy CEO, so one mm. of the yes, deputy CEOs also in the person of um, Madame Shelley Che okay. in there. So even within the commission, we've started rolling out, we've, we are engaging more women, particularly in the technical roles, mm. mining engineers. We have um, some female mining engineers and geologists on board now, okay. which didn't used to exist in the past. So in terms of the recruitment aspect, the local content, um, provision um, regulations mm -hmm. is going to take care of that. So to also look at the um, procurement aspects, mm. so that companies can also, um, in their procuring, they will look at female um, supply, ch female companies within the um, value chain, the support services. They can also look at how best to. Um, give them some contracts to be able to, to support them. On the small scale side, um, we fortunately the World Bank is supporting the commission with this um, land restoration project okay. and then we are um, and doing some geological study. So we are hoping, we've proposed with this community mining mm -hmm. scheme because that's how the, the findings, how, how it's going to be developed. So we've made proposals for at least block out areas yeah. for, for women. We are oh, hoping okay. that with time, for nothing at all, we can say that we have a model mine or an all women mine, mm -hmm. you know, within this district and to be exciting to see that as a reality. Mm -hmm. So with that project, we are hoping that yes, we're able to sensitize idea. more women. We, we have some women concession, concessionaires. Mm -hmm. The data is not too exciting, it's very low. Okay. But then we also have successes in there with people like um, Madame Amina, who have also migrated even to the extent of having a large scale, only mm. large scale mining licenses. Okay. So we believe that when the women are empowered, they will be able to take up some of the challenging rules. So those are some of the things in the pipeline mm. that um, will be. You mean, pictures of, you know, the community engagement, 
uh, Daniel, and we are showing some of those pictures there. Uh, Oba, your page on Facebook, uh, uh, live stream, and uh, some of these pictures. When you uh, uh, come education drive on, uh, yes, as I said, we had an engage. we did a collaborative work with the uh, women in mining at Savannah Tenga. Mm. So to help them with the gold capture, okay. how well they place the sluice to be able to get some more gold. And the finding was quite interesting. To find. At least they were able to increase their gold capture mm. um, by some grams. Oh, okay. which, so, yes. So we know that with more, we're also going to roll out, um, um, what do you call it? Mercury-free technology training, mm. specifically focused on the women. We are not saying that the men don't need it. They need it. But for now, let's give women the opportunity so that they can upgrade themselves, they can do things right, mm -hmm. and then they also benefit fairly from, from our sector. Oh, okay. And the question is, the young common area, and the time with the Minerals Commission, uh, how we can mainstream gender issues, uh, the commission, the policies, and also to me, I reflect Gender issues are the way they can achieve you more. Am I here? No, we can't send the brain. Ah, they are found in the monolith and not the bempa. But I want to. You be jam on my closing remarks now for young family. Um, yeah, me can say um, Obi. Um, in addition to the women, yes, the issue of um, the child labour, as I said, is very key and okay. at the heart of of, of the commission. Your best friend, your mum, your mum, your papa, no ma, omo ewo your districts, nimno. See, your friend, omo omo mano. We know they we are in hard economic times, but then they should also look at the long term effects of engaging their children in in the in the mines. Mm -hmm. Your best so I say, a maumu em fan crane em coho. What we are doing with, uh, um, with, with the child labor, as I said, the ILO started the project and then we are also picking it up. We are helping assemblies to develop bylaws. And from these bylaws, if your child is found on the mines, yebe, yebe okay. we, we, they have to be withdrawn. They may not like it, but then it has to be done. We have to do things right. So that not just for the child, but also for the nation. Yeah. We are going to spoil the future development of our kids. The child could one day become someone big within our country. Could be the president, could be a doctor, could be anybody. Yes. So we should look at that aspect and not look at the short-term gains, but rather the long-term gains. Mm. Yeah. Very well. Ma, ma ya nasi na hopefully ni yebesa in Sweden komobio ya da sepa. Why? Yes, We wish you well. Thank you. Monalen anoche bempa. Monalen anoche bempa. We are Santinio. We are Santinio. We are Santinio. Mona Lynn, I'm not even part. Yeah, that's it. Why? Miss Madam was Uko Senior High School, eh? Pachamico, St. Louis. Oh, St. Louis will come as a quasi. Hey, Mona Lynn. St. Louis will come as no one to mean catchy. Wow. Anyways, Ufri or Balegon, oh, if I try. O Balegon. Now a water hall and a day. Now a Legon Hall. Legon Hall. Matty. Matthew, and as you were saying, come over here. It was he says, I asked him, 94 points. <laughs>